Hey everyone, Hadas from Elementor here. Today we will create a cool Lost in Space sign-up pop-up using mouse track effect. Let's dig in. In Finder, search for pop-up, add a new pop-up, and give it a name. I'm going to create my own pop-up, so let's just close this. First, let's set up the size of the pop-up. In the setting tab, under layout, change the width to 600 pixel, and in the height drop-down menu, choose custom. Then change the height to 600 pixels as well, so we will get that square shape. Okay, now let's change the background of the pop-up. Under the style tab, click on the classic background type and choose a background image. Change the position to center center, choose no repeat, and set the size to cover. Cool. So all the pop-up settings are ready. Let's start working on the inside. Open a new section with one column, drag in a heading widget and a button widget, Type all the text that you need and give it some style. Okay, now we can start working on the background. Click on the section handle to enter its settings. Then, under style, choose classic background and add an image. Change the position to center center, choose no repeat, and set the size to cover. Now let's go back to the layout tab. We want the image to cover the whole square. Go to the height drop down menu and choose min height. Then make sure that the height is 600 pixel so it will match our pop-up settings. Now let's start adding our planets and give them an absolute position so we could place them wherever we want in the composition. So the design is ready, now we can move on to the mouse effect. Click on one of them, then under the advanced tab, click on motion effects and switch on the mouse effects. Now click on the mouse track editing button and change the direction to direct and the speed to 0.3. Each planet will have a different speed, so each planet will move differently from the one next to it. Let's do another one. Click on the pink planet and under the advanced tab, motion effects. Switch on the mouse effects and click on the mouse track editing button. I'm going to keep the direction here opposite and change the speed to 0.8. Now we have a cool interaction between the planets. Let's keep doing the same thing on the other images. Okay, so all our planets are moving, but the stars in the background aren't. Let's give them some motion too. Click on the section handle to enter its settings. Then, under style, switch the mouse effects to on. Click on the mouse track editing button. Keep the direction opposite and change the speed to 0.4 so it won't be too fast. Cool! So our pop-up is ready. Let's click on publish and set the conditions and triggers. Let's set it on the entire site and the trigger on page load after 3 seconds. Click on save and close and let's see it in action. Awesome! I hope you enjoyed this tutorial. Don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel to get all the latest updates and tutorials. Bye!